And what's up, you guys? It's your boy, SF Bay Area Sports Talk, and the Philadelphia Eagles have made a big splash getting their cornerback as they have acquired Darius Slay from the Detroit Lions. And in exchange, the Eagles are going to be sending a third and fifth round 2020 draft picks. Now, if you're a Philadelphia Eagles fan, I absolutely love this move for you guys. The secondary was one of the weakest links for the Eagles in 2019, and they just kept getting beat up game after game. And so you knew the Eagles were going to have to address this issue in the offseason. And if we look at free agency, the Eagles lost Malcolm C. whiffed on trying to sign Byron Jones. And so the Eagles had to make a response. And that is exactly what uh, trading for Darius Slay does. Now, what I love about Darius Slay, he is an absolute lockdown corner. And he can body with some of the biggest receivers in the game and hang with them. So, man, I love this move. Now, in order for this move to have gotten done, Eagles general manager Howie Roseman came out and said that, of course, with the Eagles having a ton of salary cap space and going into the draft, they had as many as 10 draft picks. His focus was on trying to acquire talent and big name players to this roster that are going to be with this team for the foreseeable long term. So the Eagles were able to pay uh, Darius Slay. It is a big contract, if you ask me, three years and $50 million. And this is for a guy that is going to be turning 30. But again, I love this move because the secondary was an absolute need for Now, the during his time with the Detroit Lions across seven seasons, Darius Slay had 104 pass breakups and had 19 interceptions. And more about this trade, if we go back a season ago and we look at what the Los Angeles Rams did in trading for their cornerback, they gave up two first-round picks to get Jalen Ramsey from the Jaguars. And so, man, I look at what the Eagles did. They only had to give up a third and fifth-round pick to get Darius Slay. And so, man, I just think that they nailed this trade, man. And you got to be extremely stoic and ecstatic if you're an Eagles So this fan. was a very smart move from the Eagles as they dealt from a position of strength to be able to acquire a position of need. And also they made some other free agent signings to improve that defense. They went out and re-signed Jalen Mills. So that is going to be absolutely huge. And man, I'm excited to see what the Eagles are going to do. They still, of course, are going to have eight draft picks in the upcoming draft and they still have a lot of salary cap space so really going to be intriguing to see how this all plays out moving forward now if we're going to look at this trade from the detroit lions perspective what it ultimately came down to is that they did not want to pay darius slay the type of money that he was going to command and so when the Lions realized that they weren't going to pay this guy, the best position for them was going to be to try and trade him to at least acquire some talent and get something in return. So the Lions, they did try to trade him during last season. They didn't find any potential suitors or any deals that really knocked their socks off to go out and execute the trade. But now in this case, they definitely found a suitor in the Philadelphia Eagles, and so I think it is definitely going to work out for the Lions. The other thing that the Lions did is they went out and signed a safety uh, by the name of Desmond Trufront, who had played with the Falcons prior, so once they made that signing, you knew the Lions were going to trade Darius Slay, and that is exactly and So yeah, the unfortunate tough times continue for the Detroit Lions. It just seems like they've been in a rebound rebuild for far too long and it's just really hard for them to keep you know some of their best players and pay them the big dollars you know and really try to build something great there so i'm really hoping that they can turn this around and so and so guys i hope you enjoyed today's video and if you made it all the way through to the end of this video then be sure to smash up that thumbs up button and smash that subscriber button and smash the bell button if you have not done so already, if you would like to be notified when brand new 
NFL breaking news is coming. We'll be coming to you guys live with all the latest news, free agency, and trades. And let me know down in the comment section. I would love to hear your thoughts, Eagles fans and Lions fans, on this move. I think for the Eagles, getting Darius Slay, you couldn't be happier and excited. This is a big move. The Eagles are moving in the right direction, and hopefully they can build a foundation that is going to be really good for a long time. So that's the goal. Let me know your thoughts. And same thing with the Lions. This was a rebuilding move. You know, they didn't want to pay Darius Slay, so I hope it works out for the Lions. Let me know your guys' thoughts. I always love to get your thoughts and perspective. And as always, you guys, until next time, I will see you guys again. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day.